Hey guys, what's up? It's Deadly Crest and welcome back to Lost Dimension. First and foremost, I want to say, um, since I'm using my current mic, I have to have the mic really close to my mouth because it has an even horrible time with picking up audio with my Elgato software. So if you hear me breathing a bit more, I apologize and I'm also going to try and avoid using words that have P in it, like the letter P, because uh, you can hear... I don't have like that fancy little stuff that filters that out, so you're gonna have to hear that a lot more because I can't move my mic too far away from my mouth. So anyway, let's jump right into here. Who wants? To Man, why does Nagi not want to chat? I want to chat with you, Nagi. We'll chat with Toya, I guess. Get him some friendship up. Why does everything have to have pee in it? Huh. Judgment, huh? I wonder if we're all clear now. I hate to think like this, but let's face it. There's no guarantee we won't have to do that again. You're right. I agree. Well. We have no reason to assume there's only a single traitor. So if we have to vote, we'd better make sure to erase the traitor. No. Or maybe this is all just the end's plot to divide us as a team. I wish I'd paid closer attention to him last time. God, stop with the words that have the letter P in it, please. I'm also trying to find a good way to just toss my mic cord because it's kind of in the way at the moment. Let's chat with him, you know. What? Need me again? I just like idle chit chat. I'm also going to try and be a bit louder just because I'm really making sure that my mic is picking up my voice. Um, small... Small talk's not so bad. Hmm. You're a curious one. I miss... I may dislike you more than the act of small tag it's tack. Small talk itself. But alright, I'll join you for a bit. Look, there's nothing wrong with me. I'm a rather nice person, okay? I have fancy brown hair. Kinda skinny head. But I'm I'm a good person. So do you like me by any chance? Are you thinking of hugging me? Why is that coming out of the blue? Answer in earnest when someone is asking a plain question. Haven't you learned that in elementary school? I'm asking for a yes or a no. Do you want to hug me or not? Um, well, the thought never really crossed my mind. Um, I'm thinking that more with Nagi than you. Hmm. Are you sure? It's common for people to hide their intentions. I can't trust you just because you say it out loud. I I'll admit, you know, that's a good philosophy, but at the same time, Nagi's my girl. You can't just, like try and get between us here then don't ask whether you're a man who hides his true intentions or an idiot who survives off of instinct i figured you at least choose no. not that it matters to me either way though i have no intention of accepting your friendliness tingled in sexual desire look again you're not nagi hm. it's a waste of time and unpleasant and by unpleasant, I meant emotionally. I wouldn't know in terms of physical pleasure. This is getting... <laughs> I've never had sex before. This is getting, uh, weird. I'll take your word for it. I could just sense his awkwardness in his face right there. I'm not interested in protecting my chastity, but I don't like wasting extra energy. Burn it. So if you forcefully try to win me over, I'll see you turn into ash. Look, I... How many times do I have to put it this way? You're not Nagi. I don't care for you, Himino. Asha, it doesn't sound like a joke when you say it. Well, because she can. Because it isn't. It's not far from the truth to say that I was granted this ability to burn things to the ground. No. I'm sure that's not what the ability is for. You're a great asset to our force. A great asset, huh? So what? I didn't ask for this. Not a single good thing has come from having this ability. Are you alright? You shouldn't come too close to me either. I wasn't joking when I said you turned to ash. Did something happen in the past with that power? Well, I imagine as a child, having that kind of power is probably hard to control. Just saying. I imagine anyone has trouble with it. Ah, oh, he wants to chat like that too. Ugh. Ugh. Hey, Yoko, let's have a chat, shall we? Yeah. 
It might seem impossible, but don't be discouraged. It's not good to overthink things by yourself. That's right. You're right. Thanks. Okay, that was that was fast. All right, Yoko. Great talk. Great talk. Um. Oh, she wants to talk again. Okay, let's chat again then, Yoko. Let's have more of a longer conversation this time. Hello. And goodbye. Okay, bye. Someone's in a bad mood. Hmm. You know that, yet you still come to talk. Do you like picking on people? I just wanted to come say hey. You don't have to be so rude about it. And? Something happened? Mm -hmm. I was thinking long and hard if there's any way to erase my ability. But that's... But I couldn't come up with anything. I've been trying for so long I got irritated. I, I'm sure the end could probably... If he could create this tower, I'm sure he could probably get rid of your ability for you. Or kill you, one of the two. Huh? So you were serious when you said you wanted to erase your telepathy. Well, yeah. However I think of it, it's the most unnecessary ability for me right now. Everyone's relying on you, though. Well, maybe it's useful for climbing this tower. No. But that just means it's needed by everyone else, right? I'm sure they won't need it after we defeat the end and save the world. Unless we all die. That could happen, you know. Or you could be a traitor and... You never know. I'm sure they won't need it. Alright, um... That's not true. Hmm. Now you're just humoring me, totally. I won't what? fall for that. In a peaceful world, what people want to hear is the voice of an exceptional singer. In that case, just become exceptional. That's what I've been trying to say. My ability prevents me from doing that. I think this every time I fail at singing. I can do it instantly if it's telepathy, but I don't need proficiency in that. Mm -hmm. You know, I attended an audition for new talent in the past. Everyone was amazing, so much better compared to me, with their cute voices and cute faces. I silently waited for my turn knowing that I had no chance, you know. and at that moment I came up with a method to get these kids off the stage. I could just interfere with their minds by sending out tons of telepathy and making make them stop singing. But Here we go. Mm -hmm. I didn't actually do it, of course, but you know, that option is always going to hound me. How? How can I make it go away? This episode's going to be just tons of talking for me, isn't it? Fun. Hello. I am checking out a link my friend just sent me. Why? <laughs> Why? Why did she send me that? No. Dear, I'm not. No. <laughs> That's not a good link, kids. Not a good link. I mean, not super bad. Don't don't get me wrong. It wasn't like that bad of a link. It was just um. You know just something. To think they just disappeared. This changes my entire view of reality. I wish it were something simpler, like they just got teleported, but I don't think that's the case. You're right. Not to mention, our gifts are disabled in that room. I wonder how the end keeps appearing like that. It doesn't seem fair. Well, you do that too, you know. Just saying. Oh well, fair isn't on the menu today, I guess. Let's move out. Again, you could do that yourself, but he's on a different, like, dimensional plane at the moment, so it's not like we can do anything. Let's see what depressed Marco has to say. People can just disappear like that? That means they're dead, right? I'm so sorry, but... But, Marco... I don't think I can do this anymore. Bye, Marco. Okay, great talk again as well. I am really helping improve your spears, aren't I? Huh. Now my second favorite person in the room. Hmm, to think that a person can disappear in an instant. Are you talking about the judgment? Well. Yes, I wonder how it's structured. Not only do they disappear, but they also leave a stone behind. It's sickening to think about that process. Ah, uh, but perhaps the process is not what we imagine. What if the stones are embedded into our bodies, and that device extracts it? Maybe our abilities are not because we're special, but because we were implanted with those little tiny things and it gave us... Like, they didn't know what abilities we'd get, or they did, and they just kind of planted it at birth, and then eventually we got the ability. 
that, that's even crazier to think about. You're right. I've started down a very strange path with that line of thinking. Chuckle, chuckle. I wasn't expecting it. Huh? So, you again. Looking to get punched? Dude, that's rude. Okay, I can... I have lock on, and I can easily just shoot you so easily. I mean, I'll probably I won't kill you because I'll need you to advance in the tower. But you know, I have 100% accuracy moves, and you don't. I just came to talk. What's with you? So annoying. Why are you so curious? Because I want to make friends. Is that so bad? Seriously. So, the end. You think that bastard's serious about destroying the world? No shit, he is. He's done this much already. I don't think he's messing around. <laughs> That's so, huh? Not like it matters to me either way. I mean, most humans are just wasting space anyhow. I know you think so too. I... I hate you. Let's look at our vision. How do, pe do people even like you? Besides me. Marco kind of likes you. And him, you know, for some reason. I don't... I don't... He's never even linked with her, so I don't know why that is. Um... Sure, I'll agree with you just this once. Huh, so even you see things like I do. You act all good-natured, but deep down, you're looking down on everyone. <laughs> you're a real jerk, you know that? I knew there was a reason we got along. A little. <laughs> Okay, you know what you call the people that cheer us on and watch us fix the world? Useless shitheads, that's what. If you aren't strong enough, that's your fault, right? Not really. It pisses me off when dumbasses act like they're gonna make it big and get all powerful. They call it hard work. Makes me sick watching that. That's a bit much, don't you think? That is a bit much, dude. That's why I hate you. What's wrong with working hard? It's just such a stupid attitude. The idea of hard work paying off. I hate that crap. But Hates hard work, huh? Why so much? Why so much hating him? You're never gonna make friends that way, Zenji. Oh, I get to talk to you again. Gee. <laughs> the traitor just disappeared without a trace. It's like they forgot his name already. They're just like, Bye, George. You'll forever be known as the traitor. Um... I hope, I mean, we, we're forgetting your name already, but at least we know who you are inside. Some people are still wondering if we got the real traitor or not, but I say it doesn't matter. He tried to kill Yoko. How, how is that not, how does that disprove he said, what? What? It doesn't matter. Look, it doesn't change our end goal, does it? So any hesitation is just going to slow us down. That's interesting, and it's probably the truth. I don't care if it's the truth or not. If you agree with it, then lift a hand and let's get moving. Yeah. I hate you, Zenji. But your ability is so useful later on. Damn it. Nagi, why did you not want to talk? <laughs> Alright, I suppose we can, um, since we spent 13 minutes chatting with people, I suppose we can do a mission here. Temporary bonds or lost civilization. Um, I think I'm going to go for the sub-quest this time. I believe I remember this one. Let's see, who do we want to bring along? Um, okay, so we got one voice with this. This is where I gotta get all strategical and I gotta make sure I do this right. So we got one voice, pretty much all the ladies, except for... Okay, let's, uh, let's put Toya. Who did we not have? Not you... You, and who else did we not have? You, and let's put in Marco, I guess. Let's go. I really gotta focus. I'll do most of the stuff off screen, like once we get like the... Because I'll probably have to redo certain missions and try and figure it out. So I'll do that stuff off screen, but I always make sure to do the first time that I do a mission, I'll do that on screen. That kind of fun stuff. Ah. <sighs> It's nice to record. I mean, I've been so busy with school, and I honestly, I still have a bunch of schoolwork to do. 
Thought lag, I just need to figure out what I gotta do, but I do miss being able to record often. Oh, uh, yeah, this mission. Okay. <laughs> Take this! Alright. You're not doing very much there, but hey. Nope, I wanna go up. Thank you. Well, I kinda wish I changed the position of people a bit more. Um. Let's do. Um. Yeah, let's do Gatling Wave. This one will hurt! Throw some metal. Be Magneto. Ooh, a crit. <laughs> nice. Okay, let's head up with him. And this let's take be. you down. Come on. Yeah, you did it. Nice. Okay. Good. Good. We're on a roll. Um, let's see. Let's go over here with Nagi. That's not going over here with Nagi. There we go. Now you're in our line of sight. Even so, really? You missed. You missed. God damn it. Even so, she should have more range than that, but hey. Actually, let's do some Vital Edge. Why not? There. Let's get a little bit more abilities in. Damn, that did a lot of damage. No. Can you hit this time, Nagi? Yeah, you can. Good. Okay. Ooh, we should be able to take it out now with Marco. Didn't I put Zenji in here? I thought I did. Well, I guess not. <laughs> okay, whatever. Nobody likes him anyway. Look, if you're gonna attack Marco, you should probably attack my other people first, because Marco is not going down for a while with that HP of his. So you're attacking the wrong dude. Sniper mode. Eh. You guys are lame. Don't attack my healer. That's rude. Oh oh god. Oh no. Oh, I hate these. No. He doesn't have a cure ability yet. Look, will you leave him alone? I think I'm gonna have to, uh, heal him. Up after this one. Um, let's do... Ah, I'm gonna have to move a bit closer to him. Let's do some critical hit, hopefully get that. See, I don't know why he really needs to be that close, but whatever. Then let's begin. It's fine, it's fine. Uh, let's go here. I'll heal you next. Well, I'll heal you during your turn, to be more precise. My Damn, it got a crit. <laughs> Whoops. Um. Yeah, you can't. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's give you heals capsule here. Hopefully, they won't attack you next turn. I mean, they shouldn't. Um. Let's use assassin blade. Move out. I really don't know how that helps with her levitation, but it. It just does. Oh, thank you, Marco. You're helpful. There you go. Down here is always easier to fight than up there. Let's go. So we're probably gonna get a bad grade, but hey, there's just more enemies up there in a tight, closer space than down here, so it is a bit, a bit more challenging. Ah, uh, don't do that. I hate those moves. I mean, I really love the design of these enemies a lot. I think they're really nice. But I hate their attacks. Like defense jammer, attack jammer. Joe's going to get his ass beat right here because they're probably all going to attack him. That coming. Oh, well, if they miss, that's fine. No, that one didn't. He might end up losing his sanity. Uh, or dying, one of the two. I'd rather him lose his sanity than die. Because he'll at least be helpful then. But my healer currently can't use abilities, so... Shoot. He missed. Damn it, he's dead. Okay, well... There goes you. Um... Do I have a... I do. There you go. Not much health on you, but hey... I want to at least get one of these guys killed. Is that really all? Even though the show's probably gonna die again, but whatever. I just wanted a little bit extra help, or he can distract them from attacking the other two, which wouldn't be bad either. And away we go! Come on, Aguido, let's go! Oh, hello. I did not want to go all the way up there. Let's see if we can get a crit, maybe? Nope, nope, what about- nope, okay, well, we got close. 
You think they'd do so much damage just being punched in the face like that? Right. I'd imagine that hurt a lot. Okay, we at least got one down, so we have four more. But three of them are up there. Too slow. <laughs> no. Ooh. They're they're gonna be dead up there. I at least have these guys down there, they're fine. Yeah, you have trouble running over his dead body. I don't think I'll heal him after this. I think he'll just have to stay dead. Which sucks because he's technically the main character, but you know. Toya needs to be healed. That's not good. At least you can attack back. Player phase. Damn it. Um, let's get you heal capsule. You don't need to well, maybe way. you should have. He still can't use his abilities, but he should be able to next turn, because I don't think I'll be able to finish this turn. Okay, let's take out this dude, and then we can send my other people up to help him. <laughs> Hopefully. I just gotta figure out where to go first. And away we go. This is take him out. Marco should be able to go ahead and help him out then. I I need to I think I have to go. I don't know. It's over here where I have to go. Yeah, they're all the way down there, so I gotta go over here. Okay. Make your way there, Marco. They at least gained sanity, sanity back, but it's not like they really needed it. Not good enough. Please miss. Nope. Nope. My poor healer's gonna be left all alone after this. Oh, God. An attack jammer. And he got a crit on that. Thanks. Don't worry, guys. You get... I'm still coming. Yeah, you do those crits. My pulse is irregular. Um, I'm gonna try and kind of get out of the way here and use self regen. Some piece of mind. Commencing assault. Okay, let's head up there as fast as we possibly can. Let's go. Let's go. Let's get this show on the road. Well, at least Aguido has decent distance. Let's go! Marco's not gonna make it to the ladder. Oh well, that's fine. Next turn. If my healer doesn't die on me. See, you can't even make it through. You suck. I don't care if you use that sniper mode. I'm not attacking you anyway. Look, you can't attack me either. Haha. -ha. Well, you can. But I can counter you. This may sting. Look at that distance range, man. This isn't good. You're almost dead, so let's take care of you. And then I'll get that self regen. There we go. He's gonna make it, guys. He's gonna make it. Oh. Yeah, we're kind of on the wrong side, but whatever. Let's head upward. Honestly, Sojiro might just take them all out on his own. You never know. Before they even get there, they might. I'm not gonna get a good score on this, though. I can tell you that much. I am not getting an S or an A or a B, maybe a C, but most likely ranging in the D. Yep. You can do it, Sujiro. You can live. You're a strong, independent healer. Nope, he died. Well, I'm, I'm depressed now. <laughs> So everybody's dead. Yeah, I'm gonna get the worst grade physically possible. I've never had a mission where just like everybody up and died like this. Besides one that involved like that gigantic dude that I was not prepared for. Well, that's a shame. They're just all dead on the floor. Ooh, that did more damage than I was hoping it did would. I mean, I want him to miss, but I doubt that's gonna happen all the time. Damn it! Stop it! Stop attacking Marco! He's supposed to be my tank! Commencing assault! Uh, let's use dive on you. Hopefully get you killed. Or at least Marco can give me an assist. Okay. Think nope! Marco! Okay, thanks Marco. Good job, you missed. He could've died, and I could've used a Guido to attack another one, but no. Oh, yeah, I can't. Um, 
I don't care if he dies at this point. My grade's already gonna be shit. So maybe he'll try and attack a Guido instead. Nope. Hey, you're alive. No, never mind. That's just because you recoiled. Never mind. You're dead now. Bye, Marco. Oh, this is so shameful. Just everybody's dead. At least move out. My two favorite, I mean one of my favorites, is dead over there. But at least two of my three favorites are still alive, right? You know, they're they're still holding on strong. This is so bad. We cleared the mission, though. I don't want to see the grade, however. Oh, uh, okay. Well, it's not the worst grade possible, and we did get a heal capsule and anti-confusion. Show got negative eight. Beautiful. Uh huh. Okay. Well, Lisa Guido did really well. That was worth it, right? Everybody leveled up except for Toya and those three over there. But who cares about them? All right. Let's see how many bad voices we hear in this one. I won't make any excuses to those who are killed. that's a hollow sentiment in this current situation. Okay, well we heard two, which was more than the other one. There's always going to be at least three people that are giving off those bad signals. Only one of them's going to be the traitor, though, but... There's at least three, maybe four, that has it. <laughs> What's up, Zenji? Hey, Shou, come here a sec. What's thinking about this traitor stuff? It's got to be Toya, right? I have no idea. Why are you asking me? This is my second mission. I can't make it up my mind up that fast. Make up your damn mind, will ya? You don't have time to wuss out on this. The judgment room isn't even open. Shut up, Zenji. No one cares about what you think. But everybody wants to erase Toya. Um, we don't even know if it is Toya, so... No changes, huh? Okay. Poor Toya. Everybody's on the mind of killing him for some reason. Oh dear. Okay. Let's uh let's do some chatting for the rest of the episode. Oh, there's a bunch of people. Well, maybe I'll do a few and then go into next episode. But we'll we'll chat with Nagi because I want to at least get one chat with her this episode. What is it? Ah, it's you. I'm ashamed to admit I was rattled, even if it was brief. I can't carry out normal operations in the no. state of mind. We lost one comrade. It would be weirder if you weren't shaken up by it. That may be true, but it's not a good situation either to be made a mockery by typical emotions. We must overcome everything and save the world. Otherwise, our sacrifice earlier would lose its meaning. You really are something. I feel like I'm gonna cough. And I don't want to cough. Should we chat with one more? Um, why don't we chat with Toya? I, I, we should probably chat with Mana, but whatever. It's fine. Uh. This room again. This isn't the same room, right? I mean, we definitely are up one level. Yeah, it's a different room. I don't see the marker I left behind. When did you find the time to do that? We sit around here for a good, like, ten minutes before even doing anything. Well, actually, the majority of the time we're just sitting around in here when we're not out on a mission. I mean, I suppose we have time to sleep and eat something, so I'm pretty sure he could find the time. Well. I had some free time before. Really, though, the layout of this place escapes me. I've tried several other things to try and help keep my bearings. I see. Well, I've been trying to be cautious, too. I feel every bit of information can help improve our situation. I think I agree. Maybe we should cooperate. While well, we're still able to. Aw, I think Toya wants to be good friends. We'll be good friends, Toya. I think, however, I am going to end this episode off here. One, I need a breather. And two, we're up at 29 minutes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.